Astronomers spot largest galactic structure to date, a gargantuan galaxy 16 million light years across. Named Alcyonus, after one of the giants of Greek mythology, this gigantic galaxy spans 5 megaparsecs, or 16.3 million light years in length. Alcyonus, the biggest galactic structure ever discovered, Located about 3 billion light years from Earth, Alcyonus is what is known as a radio galaxy, so named because the energy that comes from it, is mainly emitted in the radio wave range by synchrotron radiation. Thus, it consists of a host galaxy, a cluster of stars orbiting a core containing a supermassive black hole, and giant jets and radio clouds, the latter accelerate electrons that generate radio emission. The central black hole, estimated at about 400 million solar masses, is the source of the observed plasma jets. What are plasma jets? These huge ultra-fast jets are relatively common in space. Active black holes in the center of galaxies do not absorb all the surrounding matter, some of it is sent to the poles of the accretion disk, where it is ejected in the form of jets at tremendous speeds. They can travel long distances, eventually forming what are known as radio lobes, which they continue to feed over time. But in some cases, this phenomenon leads to the formation of giant radio galaxies several megaparsecs long. The physical mechanisms that support this extreme growth are not yet fully understood. How big do radio galaxies get? Some radio galaxies can actually reach more than 100 times the diameter of the host galaxy. Therefore, scientists are trying to determine whether there are certain features of the host galaxies, or specific large-scale environments that favor the growth of giant radio galaxies, the discovery of Alcyonus as the largest radio galaxy ever discovered, therefore, is an excellent object to study. As an extreme example of its class, Alcyonus may shed light on the underlying mechanisms governing the growth of radio galaxies. By studying the characteristics of the host galaxy Alcyonus, the researchers hope to discover the key elements, and conditions necessary for the development of such galaxies. What do we know about Alcyonus? Examining the LOFAR data, with careful elimination of all radio sources that could interfere with the waves emitted by the radio beams, they discovered Alcyonus, which they describe as the largest known galactic structure, with an estimated size of at least 5 megaparsecs, or more than 16 million light years. By comparison, Messier 87, another giant radio galaxy in the Virgo cluster, is estimated to be almost a million light years across. The data show that the host galaxy has an elliptical shape, a stellar mass of about 2.4 by 1011 solar masses, and a supermassive black hole of about 4 by 108 solar masses at its center. Alcyonus is suspiciously ordinary. Martin Wee, an astronomer at the Leiden Observatory in the Netherlands, and his collaborators note, however, that Alcyonus and its host galaxy seem suspiciously ordinary, total low frequency luminosity density, about 8 by 1025 W slash HZ, stellar mass, and the mass of the supermassive black holes are increasingly lower, although close, to the values usually observed for this type of galaxy. For comparison, the mass of M87 is about 1012 solar masses, and the mass of M87 dash the supermassive black hole at its center is estimated at about 6.5 billion solar masses. Thus, it appears that the growth of giant galaxies does not require very massive galaxies or central black holes, as well as high power radio emission, the researchers add. On the other hand, the low density of the environment remains a possible explanation. In addition, the host galaxy is located in a filament of the cosmic web, with which it can have significant thermodynamic interaction. The fact that Alcyonus is located in a region of low-density space and or its interaction, with the intergalactic medium may be the key to its disproportionate expansion. According to the researchers, the calculated pressure in the lobes, on the order of 5 by 10 to 16 pascals, is the lowest found so far, therefore, Alcyonus represents the most promising radio galaxy to date for the study of the hot intergalactic medium. While the team has not yet been able to determine the exact reason for its expansion, they believe it is still expanding, 